are we here? Ooh, it's one of those street side places. It looks cute and cozy. Welcome. Oh, Miss Kiminami. How do you do? Oh, Miss Kamisato. Perfect timing. Your booking was for... Well, right now. I believe so. We'll be sticking to the order I placed in advance. As for the other matter we discussed, thank you for your help. Excellent. No problem. And everything you asked for is ready and waiting. Traveler, tiny customer, please wait here for a moment while I prepare your food. Go ahead and take a seat. There is something I need to take care of, but I'll be back momentarily. <clears throat> it's nothing of that sort. I just have a few minor things I need to attend to. I won't be long. She sure left in a hurry. Whatever it is, it must be pretty urgent. So you two are Miss Kamisato's friends? <laughs> well, we serve all the classics. Sure, there are fancier looking places out there, but the food here speaks for itself. Hope you enjoy it. Over the years we've been in business, we've gotten to know the Kamisato clan quite well. Miss Kamisato and her brother are both fond of our food. They're always sending staff down here to order something and take it back to them. Her table booking surprised me. Not least because it was a group reservation. This is the first time I've ever heard of Miss Kamisato going out for dinner with friends. The first time ever? Oh, guess that makes us pretty important people, huh? Sure does. And I'm probably crossing the line here, but I'm just telling you what others have told me. Apparently, Miss Kamisato doesn't have a lot of friends. How is that possible? She's so kind and polite to everyone. Paimon would have thought that would make her really popular. That's what I used to think, too. But it turns out the rules of social interaction are a bit more complicated than that. Nobody in the neighborhood has a bad word to say about her. They all say she's beautiful, elegant, graceful. Not to mention that she belongs to one of the most illustrious clans in the land. In short, they see her as a model young lady. But that's just it. People look at her and they see a model of perfection. And they don't feel like that's something they can relate to. So the majority of kids from our ordinary... On paper, she sounds like a girl everyone would want to get to know. But in practice, she finds it difficult to make friends. Huh. Paimon never would have guessed. We don't speak all that much, but we do go quite a way back. I've always admired her for taking on so many responsibilities at such a young age. So it makes me really happy to see her here with friends today. Anyway, relax, enjoy your meal, and please talk to her as much as possible. I know she'll appreciate it. Consider it a favor for the whole neighborhood. Look after her for us. <laughs> huh? That sounded like Ayaka! I'm so sorry, Traveler. Could you join me over there for a minute? Um, I need your help with something. I'm sorry. I didn't want to drag you away all of a sudden. I, um, just had a cooking catastrophe. Oh, so that loud noise we heard came from the cooking pot. As you can see... This house is right next to the restaurant. It's where the owner lives. Actually, this whole compound is the family's private property. I asked Miss Kiminami to prepare some ingredients and utensils for me so that I could cook a special dish here. Right! If there's something you want to eat, you could just order it from the menu. Actually, I wanted to cook something as a gift for Tsubaki. My mother mentioned in her notebook that Tsubaki enjoys food from all over the world. So I thought, if I'm going to meet Tsubaki, perhaps a dish from overseas would make a fitting gift. A dish from overseas? So anything from outside Inazuma counts, right? If so, then we've got lots of options, don't we? Hey! Don't make this weird! Can I leave you to finish this task, then? Just as a personal favor. Is that okay? I'll be indebted to you. Great. But... 
What kind of overseas dish would make a suitable gift? It needs to survive a journey from the kitchen to the recipient's doorstep. Oh, Paimon knows! There's one dish out there that was practically created for this purpose! Pizza! Pizza? It's an assortment of toppings and sauce spread over a bread base and cooked in the oven. And it's so good! That does sound pretty good. Is the pizza ready? 